took my bike outside of the storage room to outside on the street because someone is moving in currently right now into my apartment building. Uh, but just gonna be riding on the bike for 40 minutes at 145 watts, which is probably about 75% of my uh, 20 minute FTP score. So yeah, high tech knowledge right there. But yeah, I'm gonna be riding for 40 minutes, scoring. I don't think you guys really wanna watch this. I'm gonna put my headphones in and just get started. first session now I'm about to make a post-workout protein shake if you guys want this recipe it will be in this video right here but in the meantime I'm gonna make this smoothie um, I this is my go-to one I drink after probably every morning session so the only thing we're missing is dates but I'll just say they're in there or I'll just say it didn't happen today. yeah so you should put it in there Along with the bananas. Along with the bananas. Along with the bananas. So we have these nice frozen bananas here. And this is that. Okay. Oh, we have these nice frozen bananas. It's funny off camera. Let's see if the camera goes on. Good thing I already got that. Did you really know you did? I guess I don't really vlog too much, so I'm still super uncomfortable on the camera, um, but finally getting back to it, I guess with quarantine and COVID everything, I haven't really updated you guys what exactly has been going on with my life right now, but um, it's July and all my competitions this year have pretty much been postponed or canceled. I was actually supposed to compete in Mayhem Madness in about three weeks and then that just got postponed to end of August, which I'm super bummed about. Um, but actually it came at a good time just because I've actually been feeling a little bit under the weather. Um, just congestion, but it's also had me stay away from the gym. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys a little bit what my training is like, which you guys can find more about in this video right here. But basically I'm not able to train at the gym right now just because I don't wanna risk getting anyone else um, congested or sick. I don't really feel like I'm sick, but I'm congested. So I just don't wanna risk it. So if you are feeling any symptoms, stay home everyone. Um, but with that being said, I guess I'll share more exciting updates um, as we kinda of get going. Are you doing the vlog? No. You're not gonna be in the vlog? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you so embarrassed? I'm not embarrassed, I just don't want to be in the vlog. Well, <laughs> vlog, not vlog. Well, you're kind of too late about that. <laughs> this is live. Did you know that this is live? Grass, I, I, I figured out how to do YouTube live. <laughs> like, this is actually connected via Wi Fi. I didn't what tell you guys. I you're gonna be on the vlog if you hate it or if you like it or don't like it. Oh, no one is jealous of my life right now. <laughs> I'm a tea girl. I don't drink coffee. Everyone always asks, like, do you drink coffee? And I always just tell them, green tea. I mean, I, this is literally like my tea drawer. So much tea in there. So then this is just a big coffee maker for show? It's just for show, you know, it just looks good. It looks good in the corner. No, it's Rasmus's uh, coffee maker. He actually drinks coffee in the morning. Um, and he tried to get me into it and I just, I don't know, it makes my heart race. I don't really- This is really fancy. Ras, you should make some coffee for us and then it can go along with the banana in your stomach. <laughs> Are you usually asking for a coffee, basically. Are you asking for a coffee right oh, now? Low key, yeah. You want to make one? I'll make one. <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> yeah, I'll Thank make you. I'll make one myself too. It sounds good, actually. <laughs> I need to make one. 
<laughs> Wait, I think you said that you make some bomb coffee now that no, I remember. No, I don't. I, I'm trying to. I'm learning. I think he actually makes really good coffee. And it's at. I don't like coffee. Don't well, we have coffee from Colombia. So we went to Colombia in December and like he bought like literally how many bags of beans? We came back with like 12 bags of beans from Colombia. And we were still going through it. No, these are not from Colombia anymore. Oh, they're not from Colombia anymore. Scratch that, but they're still really good. All right, everyone, we're at Grown Strong headquarters of just an actual loading dock where people move in at my apartment. But every time I've actually been shooting my workouts here, people think that I'm in some fancy gym and they're probably wondering where exactly I'm at. And it's not so fancy. I mean, there's just some trash rolling out, so I dismissed it. Um, but yeah, we're about to shoot some workouts for the social media, for Grown Strong social media, but Again, another reason why I'm vlogging, I want to update you guys what is going on with my life from training to grown strong and everything else in between. Uh, we have a lot of exciting things going on. We're expanding. Uh, we're going to be, or we're going to start working with influencers for grown strong, which is going to probably be a whole nother video where I will share um, all the latest and exciting things we're going to be doing for GS. But yeah, here we go for the workouts. All right, we just wrapped up filming some workouts for the Grown Strong social media. Now I'm eating here. I have rice, ground turkey, and then I also made Rasmus and I my signature power greens uh, smoothie or juice, whatever you want to call it. I've been calling it the LF power green smoothie. So I'm excited for you guys to see Rasmus's reaction when I tell, tell him that I made the LF power green smoothie because it is just straight, pretty much greens. I added celery, chard, water. I usually add lemon, but I had no lemon. I added ginger, spinach, and a little bit of blueberries for a little bit of taste, but I don't think you're gonna taste them. I you mean the bower greens? Huh? I made you the I made you the signature LF power greens. I'm not having any comments. Huh? I made you the signature <laughs> LF power green smoothie. No, I love it. It's right there. He just hung up the or closed the door on me. No comments. <laughs> <laughs> then go right here. That actually scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Holy crap. I knew you were, I was like, oh. he probably doesn't know how well. <laughs> These 
out of it. <sighs> Someone pushed hard. I did 22 calories. Huh? I did 22 calories. I did 10 um, calories every, well, every time. Okay. Do you want to close out the vlog? Not really. Come on, you're better. Bye, guys. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Today is July 10th, and we are supposed to be getting married in two months on September 3rd, 2020. September 5th. September 3rd. September. September 3rd, 2020, so that's supposed to be in less than 60 days. I was supposed to be having my bachelorette party, supposed to be doing a bridal shower, all of it, but news is everyone, latest updates, we had to postpone our wedding due to COVID, so now we are getting married June 2nd, 2021. Um, we were pretty sad about it, but I think it's the best thing just with everything going on in the world right now. I was going to say pretty happy about it. Why were we pretty happy? I'm ready in 60 days, are you kidding me? There is no way we were ready to have a wedding in 60 days. Um, so it was actually kind of a blessing in disguise, uh, just with everything going on. Uh, now we have all of our vendors. Pretty much we're able to move to the new date, so we're really lucky about that. Um, the only thing that didn't move over to the new date was our musician, but we're actually really excited because then I actually ended up getting the musician I wanted, so I'm super excited about that. Um, but if you guys have also haven't heard, our wedding is going to be in Santorini, Greece. So a destination wedding, June 2nd, 2021. Hopefully we're able to travel with everything going on and hopefully 2021 gets back to normal. Come join us. Come join us. Yeah, Santorini, nice little cozy island. It's a, pri it's, <laughs> it's a private island. No, but I'm saying our wedding is not an invite to everyone. Hmm. Huh? Okay. And it's a wrap. Done? Was that really the end of the vlog? It's supposed to be a sad thing. It's kind of a happy thing, to be honest. It's <laughs> <laughs> true. What are you doing? It's supposed to be a fake kiss. <laughs> and that's the end. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm going to be doing more of these. Please comment down below what you want to see, whether it's wedding planning, training, um, recipes. Comment down below. We'd love to hear from you boring stuff. Well, what do they want to see? I don't know. You tell me. Why don't they tell us? Maybe they want to see more Rasmus. No. I won't be in the next one. <laughs> okay.